research, Note 7. The gods have blessed us with a new discovery. The blood of Loki seems to be the key to immortality. It is said to have magical healing capabilities. This is great news. Soon, the grasp of sickness will be lifted from you. Research note eight. This will be the last note for a while. A lot of things have happened, and we did some research on the god of mischief, Loki, in, in note two. The myth tells the story of the mischievous god Loki being locked underground forever, with acid slowly dripping on his flesh. But there seems to be more. To make sure that Loki could never deceive anyone ever again with his shape-shifting, a mask was molded onto his skin with powerful magic to ruin the attractive face Loki was so fond of. The mask would not only make sure that if the shape-shifting god would ever escape his imprisonment, he could be recognized, it would also start interfering with the shape-shifting itself. It would cause Loki to lose control of his form, to, to stop him from purposefully taking any 
any specific shape or form, effectively ending his days of deception. I'm, I'm so sorry. I, I couldn't finish it. You, you have to run. Run away. Henrik. You, you're back. It, it, it cannot be. You, you, you must. Did, did Loki do this to you? Oh, Loki. He will pay. I swear to it. A, a soul stone. You have to bring one of them here. There's one in the room across. Thank you. 
This isn't enough power to destroy Lopes. We have to find more power to destroy that bastard. And to accomplish this, there are a lot of questions to answer. Questions about me. When Loki had your name, he had something in mind. A great purpose. Now I suspect that to find out more in Helheim, so I need you to find another route back there. Helheim, stop ordering me around. If you know so much about me, then just tell me. I need to know. When Loki... When Loki cut my body in half, in his indulgence of my torture, he spoke of his daughter. Her name was Hell, and she died long ago. The things he said makes me think that the artifact tissue used for your creation was from Hell herself. Loki wanted his daughter back. Yes, so he made you. Right now, nothing in Midgard has the power to stand up against Loki, so our best chance is starting at your roots and search from there. Since the Absalom is out of control and the roots of Yggdrasil are spreading, there should be one leading to Helheim. Have you seen any route that could lead us there? I did see one. In the West Wing. A freight elevator. It can take us to a place with a route I used to get out of Helheim. Now we're willfully going to the world of the dead. This is crazy. Four, two, Absalom research. I can't believe this. The keys open the Absalom. The roots are going to start spreading faster. We better hurry.
my senses. I twist them. I can see all around with no eyes. I can speak clearly with no throat. that gap somehow. Hmm. Those pillars on the other side. I'm not sure, but I think you can activate them with a shot from Young Draper. The energy 
Yamaguchi signature of that shrine is very similar to Atrium. I think you can charge the Yamagai a little bit. in the books. The Temple of the Goddess Hell. Wait, what did the book say? Odin's heart filled with rage as his son drew his last breath. To bring him back from darkness, he paid his way with death. The gates will remain locked until the one demanding passage can prove themselves. It's unlocked with sacrifices. Sacrifices? What, what type of sacrifices? The Keepers of Helheim, slaying nine in the chosen hunting grounds close to the temple.
worker journey and daughter of Loki, ruler of Helheim, destroyed by the gods as vengeance for the death of Odin's son. Did she really deserve this? Maybe not. Look, beside the throne, the light. possible on this. By the gods, your body truly has the essence of hell inside. You're a half-god, whose power has been returned to you. The power to draw strength from death. The spirits, draw power from them. Destroy the lock, holding us in this room, and let's get back to Midgard and end the Loki. 